Many people with increased health risks are eager to get their chance to get the vaccine. Pregnant women are considered to be in phase two of the state's allocation plan, but vaccine research is limited. Way 31's Grace Campbell heard the concerns some pregnant women have when it comes to getting the vaccine. Grace. Cassie Harbin told me she is just waiting to get the coronavirus vaccine and she's hoping that she will be eligible to get it before her baby girl is born in June. The second I see it, I'll sign up. <laughs> Definitely. Cassie Harbin said she is overall healthy, but her pregnancy is the only thing putting her in the high risk category. Even though she's a stay at home mom, her husband and brother both work in high contact environments so she could potentially be exposed to the coronavirus daily when they come home. If it was any other time, I'd probably be like, mm, I'll wait until I'm not pregnant. But no, <laughs> it's, it's not worth the risk to me. You know, it's just I'm more worried about getting COVID than I am about getting a vaccine. The CDC says pregnant women are at an increased risk of getting severely sick from COVID-19. That's why Huntsville Hospital OBGYN Dr. Whitney Dunham thinks it's important pregnant women think about getting vaccinated. Their immune system is different when they're pregnant than when they're not pregnant. Um, so if they are considering not getting the vaccination, they should probably rethink that. There's limited information on pregnant women receiving the COVID-19 vaccine and Harbin acknowledges it. I feel like with anything that's unknown, especially when you're pregnant, it's scary. Dr. Dunham wants to stress the importance of speaking with your doctor about whether or not you should get the COVID-19 vaccine once you're eligible to. Reporting live in Huntsville, Grace Campbell, Way 31 News.